on to your communication studio. A tribute to heroes was made today at Hazel Ruby McQueen Park in Morgantown. The community honored first responders and veterans. Megan Hudak reports. The city of Morgantown honored Gene Vance Jr., who was the first West Virginia National Guardsman to be killed in action since World War II. 2016 marks the 15th year anniversary of 9-11. Vance served to fight the war on terror. The war continues on today, and men and women of America are, are at war with our enemy. So we wanted to take this opportunity to honor those in the memory of Gene, and we are very, very humbled by the great honor and great privilege that's being bestowed upon not only our family, but all our men and women in uniform. Mayor Marty Schamberger proclaimed the 22nd of May in 2016 as Gene Vance Jr. Day in the city of Morgantown. A memorial drive is being dedicated in honor of Staff Sergeant Gene Vance Jr. We are excited that our city council had approved and passed. Um, we're designating a memorial highway in Gene's honor, so we're excited about the dedication of that today and also the opportunity to honor all of our service men and women and all those who have fallen too. The reading of the names of the fallen, a flag ceremony, and 21 gun salute were a part of the full ceremonial military honors program. Distinguished guests from the senator's office, delegates from the state, as well as the military were in presence. And for us it will be a, a ceremony that we hope will be memorable and representative of what we are as Americans, uh, supporting all those men and women in uniform who are taking the fight to the enemy right now. As we speak. Gene Vance Jr. Day falls between Armed Forces Day and Memorial Day and reminds everyone to never forget the sacrifices being made. Reporting in Morgantown, I'm Megan Hudock for 12 News. Now